Alright guys, welcome back to Wolfenstein 2, Gunslinger Joe, start volume 2 on the run. All I wanted to do was play ball. Out there, I was free. Out there, no one could touch me. After the war, my father formed a resistance group with some friends. They fought hard, with every inch of their lives. Eventually, like most of the resistance groups out there, they were captured. The sky was the color of fire the day Uber Commander Netza took Papa away. Same color as the fire fading out inside me. If anyone needs me, I will be at the secret police headquarters. Heil Hitler! Yes, Commandant. Heil Hitler! Now the Nazis were about to put an end to my story. Well, that's what they thought. <laughs> One thing was clear. Metza was a dead man walking. Ah, where the hell am I? And here he is! Gunslinger Joe Stallion! What the hell is going on here? Welcome onto the field, Gunslinger Joe Stallion. Ah, it's game time. Let's hear that, folks! Holy... First quarter! Let's give a warm welcome to our boys, the German elite! Gotta get that shotgun. And I'm dead. It's supposed to happen, don't worry. What a game, folks! Score one for the home team! I know what I can throw. Don't care for it. What? Let's see. You got the signal 20 meters away. No silencer, so no reason to. Hast du's Metze schon gesagt? Mach ich, wenn ich ihn sehe. Er ist doch direkt nebenan. Wie geht's? Alles klar? Ah, shit. Did not think they would just be standing right there. Well, I'm definitely using that to my advantage right now, aren't I? Alright, let's see. You got a shotgun. Let's make sure it's loaded. Make sure this is loaded as well. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, we got the Magnum upgrade. Oh, God. Okay, it was right there. Man, I'm... T <laughs> I'm dying a lot in this. Oh, I don't have. Why do I hardly have any health? I thought I 
picked up just about a hundred when I got down here. Guess not. Really, just a helmet. It's a good thing you picked up grenades because it'd be hard to fight like six guys at once with 40 health. Never mind, we just keep having to do it. Oh, I thought this was a dude. Oh, something in my eye. Oh, we got a map. Finally, we got all our health back. Open the warehouse doors. Not sure how he died from that, but whatever. Oh, I thought I could just get in there. <laughs> Have a grenade. Whoa. Honestly, I don't know where that grenade went, so I did not go out there. I don't know what that is that I put on there. Oh, it's the nail gun. Not too useful right now. Okay, I'll see if I can cheese it, I guess. Alright, now that everybody's dead, let's go ahead and look for some health. Because I'm back down to 40. Overcommandant Metz's note, despite difficulties caused by this little insurgence, our objective remains the same. Conditions in the area may not be favorable, however, so we shall be moving to the center of our operations from Springfield to a different location. I will convey the location at a later date. I don't want any of the resistance or whatever those criminals call themselves to know our plans. Oh, I guess I ain't getting any more health. Get out of the I knew one thing. 
that I would introduce Metza to the bitter taste of revenge. The taste of dirt after getting laid out by a man you shouldn't have pushed into a corner. The hell? Oh, armor. Okay. Like, what the hell is this? Oh, Ava's note. Yes. Citizens are unhappy and ready to fight back. Finally, Stalin's uprising has ignited the patriotism in the citizens of Springfield, Chicago, Peoria. All over. We finally got our chance to fight back. We know they're where they're taking Joe, but not sure about the rest of his soccer team. But it might be too late for them. A high-value captive was escorted into the station recently. Maybe it's related? We should investigate. Hey. Springfield was a ghost town, like the quiet before a coming storm. I was gonna say. The clan's everywhere. Shit. Oh wow, they really are. Got three grenades. All right, one goes to you. My fellow Americans, this is oh, wow, there's two of them. Both dead. Good riddance to these terrorists with their lies about the resistance. They are rotting teeth that need to be pulled out. They just want to murder innocent people like you, trying to live in peace. Trust me, I'm a real American just like you. And I know that our destiny is to serve the Fuhrer. We are part. What the hell? <clears throat> oh, we got the armor piercing, I guess.
get past Panzerhund. Get over there, okay. Give it the can. Didn't know there was gonna be one of those dudes just waiting for me. Oh, good thing I reloaded. that can back. <coughs> Springfield Post, Evening Edition, March 12th, 1960. Ultra mentioned are who we thought they were by Klaus Mueller. With their disgraceful insult during the Uber Bowl, the Ultra mentioned have once again proven they are exactly who they thought they were in a barbaric display. Ultra mentioned Joe Stallion disrespected the beautiful game of football as well as our distinguished guests from Berlin. This disgusting act raises the question of whether or not the Uttermenschen are fit for society if they act in this manner when given an opportunity. We at the Springfield Post are truly saddened by the display and offer our deepest apologies to our guests from the fatherland. On behalf of the Post and society at large, we urge citizens to report the location of any Uttermenschen or other suspicious citizens you believe to be conspirators of these foul criminals. Didn't see a damn thing. It never will again. Enter Secret Police HQ. Didn't see you there, buddy. Shotgunner. Wow, I only have 40 health again. That is like my number. There we go. That was a weird spray. Wow. Oh, 
Oh, that kind of scared me. I was gonna say, need some kind of health. Again. Buddy. Yeah, all that commotion outside, it was nothing. Huh. Yeah. That was horse shit. Damn it, that grenade sucked. No one's coming, buddy. Oh, say what the hell's hey, up there? Joe, say hi to the surveillance cameras. You really embarrassed me in front of the Oberkommando, Joe. I told them you were dead. Dead. A slave embarrassing an Oberkommandant of the Reich? Embarrassment, Joe. There is nothing I hate more than being caught with my pants down. Hurry up. So I found an old friend of yours, deep in a coal mine outside Hillsboro. Let's see, Uber Commandant met his order to Commandant Waltz. I fear the situation may have grown out of control. Once uh, we regain control, it may be difficult to find any living untermentioned specimens. As such, we should double recruiting efforts in Omaha, Pierre, and Gary. Cease operations in Topeka. We should keep eyes off that facility if we can avoid it. As to the facilities in Des Moines, Chicago, and Indianapolis, dispose of any remaining specimen, consolidate all active personnel to higher priority facilities, the specimen locked in the Springfield facility should not be touched. He is critically important to that particular facility. Mets. Why are we so important? He's waiting for you in the room at the end of the hall. Consider this my gift to you, Joe. See you around, gunslinger. Papa? That, that you, son? I can't go on no more. My spirit's leaving me. Get on out of here. Forget it. The stallions are no quitters, old man. Hell's bell, son. Yeah. Papa had ignited the fire inside. I wasn't about to let Metza get to my family. I had passed through the eye of the storm. And 
come out as something else. A beast of vengeance. A machine built to destroy Nazis. <laughs> built to destroy. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and uh, end it here. I guess we'll just do three for each one. Um, the next one is Showdown. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Have a great day and I'll see ya. Bye.